Welcome to Coffee Break. My name is Michael Moret, reading today from Isaiah 53, verse 8. He was taken from prison, speaking of Jesus, and from judgment. And who shall declare his generation? For he was cut off from the land of the living. For the transgression of my people was he stricken. And he made his grave with the wicked and with the rich in his death, because he had done no violence, neither was any deceit in his mouth. And both these things came to pass. Jesus died next to two wicked criminals, and he was buried in a rich man's grave. Just exactly what the Bible said would happen. Precisely. Jesus fulfilled the Messianic Scriptures to a T during his life, during his ministry, and even at his death, and after his death, of course, with the resurrection. And no deceit was found in his mouth. That means everything Jesus said about himself was true. And if you don't want to just take his word for it, or God's word for it, then consider the resurrection. Because if he ever would have lied even one time, he would have stayed dead. He never sinned, including he never told a lie. That's why death could not hold him. So when he said, I'm the way, the truth, and the life, no one comes to the Father except through me, you better believe it. It's the truth. When he talks about hell being a place of eternal torment, you better believe it because he told the truth. You better believe the words of Jesus. I want to believe whatever Jesus believes about any subject, because I know I'm safe. He never lied. He's Almighty God. This has been Michael Moret with another coffee break.